Hello out there and welcome to English Teacher in Plays. In the middle of the 13th century, <laughs> the army of the Crusaders is entrenched behind fortified walls in the Holy Land. The Saracens hold sway oh, in the East, but oh. their grip is threatened by new conquerors, the Mongols. Their sovereign, Kublai Khan, is lord of all Asia. His alliance with the Christians could disrupt the Arab Empire. Okay. Intrepid merchants set off from Venice to serve Christianity, but also to seek their fortune as they make their long journey to distant <laughs> oh China. My God. But the road to Kambaluk is a long one and riddled with all kinds of hazards. Wow. Just wow. Oh, we've got some full motion video. Oh, dude. Legit. <laughs> because because that's relevant look there's a goat in the river and some fog oh we're walking we're traveling right now I guess that's what's going on I think my I think it's quite loud maybe um Hopefully it's not too loud. Hopefully you guys can still hear me. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Marco Polo. Nice. A Philips Interactive Media France production. Okay. Okay, well... Oh, Jesus. What is documentation? Jesus. Okay. Uh, it's a very small screen, so I'm going to turn my uh, mouse down. Okay. The Mongols... What? Techniques? Oh my god. Okay. No, I don't, I don't want to do any of that. I want to I wanna go back. After a sojourn of more than 20 years, the Polos left China. They went by sea as part of a flotilla of 14 Chinese vessels, and spent nearly two years at sea, guided by the compass. This instrument, which was known in Chinese as the needle that points south, undoubtedly a reference to the magnetized spoon which had existed before the Christian era, and which was used by geomancers to detect the flow of forces in the earth. The spoon later gave way to a needle, and was used by Chinese navigators before the 11th century. Okay. Um, oh my god, I don't, I want to, I want to go back, oh, there we go, oh, no, that doesn't take me back, oh my god, so does each of those have its own thing, I'm just, this is one sub-menu, oh my gosh, okay, okay, um, how do I get back though, um, oh, okay, there we go, right, mission's, Techniques, the Mongols, economic life, society, travels, legends. Wow, okay, legends. Oh, wow. There is, there is so much. In his narrative, oh. Marco yields to the tradition of the books of marvels by referring to the various monsters which he might have encountered. Hairless men with large tails like those of dogs from the island of Sumatra or men with the heads of dogs from the Andaman Islands in the Gulf of Bengal, or deformed giants from Zanzibar. These monsters <laughs> recur in the narratives of all the travelers Amazing! Of the time, and were a source that of is amazing. for illustrators. John de Mandeville suggested many strange races. That chick has men ten boobs. Men who went on all fours, hermaphrodites, <laughs> or men without heads who had eyes and a mouth in the middle of their chest. Okay, what, what does this button do? Oh right, that's the the text. Okay, I want to I want to go back. Um, I want to go back. In a poor no, nope. uh, menu. I don't. God, there's so many of these. I just need to get back to the to the main menu. How do I? A legend. No, how do I go back? A legendary. No, back. Back. I want to play the game. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Why is there no back button? In the land of Nope. No. In the land of No. Okay, well I'm gonna restart and uh and come back in. So that's what that's what's about to happen. Okay, so I've restarted. We're gonna go ahead and just start start the game. Number of players one. Number of weeks, sure. Whatever the default is, let's just go. Um Okay, I guess I'll be Nicolo. Choose a starting town. Laius Karakum Tobiner or let's let's start in these mountains up here. Let's go. Let's start. The adventure begins. Okay, so so this is Marco Polo. This is on Steam, but it is obviously from a different time period. It's it's brand new today, just been released, but I don't know what the I don't know what the market is for this, but it seems very in depth with lots of like video and stuff. <laughs> um, uh, also, I just wanted to say I'm sorry that I haven't been posting recently. I had some personal problems back home, so I had to do some international traveling to go to some funerals and stuff. So. It hasn't been amazing for me. Um, let's go to the town center. Okay, the Tartar's weapons are bows and arrows, swords and iron maces and axes. Okay? But they- oh my god. Okay. Encounter. Do you want to ob yes, let's obtain some in copper is very much sought after by our harness makers. Okay, purchase. Not available, none of it. Oh, I can buy some arts and crafts. Ordered. I can buy some jewels, there we go. You will find here the best quality the country has to offer. <laughs> um, okay. I don't, I don't know. I don't, okay. Buy it. Go. Purchase. Did I buy it? I don't have enough money for this transaction. I don't have enough money for this transaction. I also have no idea why I'm doing any of this. Uh. Right. Okay. I have, it looks like I have 600 money. So I can buy... I don't know. Uh, we'll figure this out. We're gonna figure this out. Let's buy some stuff. I mean, this is thrilling so far. I like the I like the music and the and the talking and stuff, but I don't I don't get it. All right, let's get under six hundred, and then we'll say let's buy it. There we go, buy it. That's my final offer. Take it or leave it. Okay, buy it. All right. Okay. Right. I don't. I don't know what just happened. Missions in progress. I have no missions in progress. Okay. How do I? Okay. Well. I can't. I can't get out of this. Great. Love it. Okay, let's just go look at the description because this is, this is nonsense. Um, okay, Marco Polo. The art of bargaining lies in the knowing how far, in knowing how far you can go. Fame, fortune, and adventure lie ahead. Uh, Infro Games, publisher Classics Digital. Right. Uh, discover the world of Marco Polo as you travel the legendary silk route from the Holy Land to China. Match yourself against the colorful underworld of the middle age marketplace where strategy and bargaining skills will guide you. Arms and merchandise are your wares, but secrets too must be bartered. As a special messenger to the Pope or counselor to Kublai Khan, the Mongol Emperor, you'll build your wealth and prestige by carrying out challenging missions. Knights will defend you, but thieves lie in wait. Experience your own epic adventure. Features multiplayer competition with up to four players, hours of gameplay with 63 towns to discover, and 334 different trading missions. 2,000 digitized images and extensive video sequences chronicling life in the 13th century. Right. Okay, so let's go look at Infrogrames. 
Uh, looks like they've made tons of stuff. Well, I say tons, but just this stuff. Um, Bubble Ghost. Yeah. I'm just trying to see, are, are these all, like, old-timey games? So this game got released today as well, Draken. Um, Alone in the Dark 1. Right. So Alone in the Dark... Okay, so this is the game Alone in the Dark back in the day. Is that right? Okay. Okay, so they it looks like they publish uh, old, old games and uh, bring them to the PC. Um, let's look at Classics Digital. Let's see, what, yeah, they're, they they've done more. Oh no, it's mostly look. There's Alien Rampage. Look at that Ragnarok. Right. Okay, so we have Marco Polo, which after playing it for about eight minutes, I can tell you has tons and tons of stuff. Wow, that's like that looks way higher res than it looked on my screen, and it looked terrible on my screen. I don't, that guy's obviously asking a question or something. Um, right? We saw that in the middle. Yeah, we saw that as well. Right, and we got to the arts and crafts. So we, uh, we did well. Um, it's $7.55. It's arcane as anything. Like, I'm sure there's a game to be played in there somewhere, but I have no idea how to do it. And it doesn't, it's not, it's not keen to tell me. So... I don't know, man. I don't know. If you're a glutton for punishment and super interested in Marco Polo, the Silk Road, and the 13th Century, then this might be a game that you really want to check out. But uh, other than that, I would probably say stay away. That's just my own opinion. Uh, for $7.55, you can get some much better games uh, that uh, don't require a master's degree to get it in play. So uh, I'm going to leave it there. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being patient with me. I'm sorry that I haven't been updating. Um, it's just, it is what it is. Uh, I was not anywhere near a computer where I could update. So, but I'm back now and we're going to be back to our regularly scheduled program. So thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking with me and I'll see you next time. Class dismissed.